Hey guys, and welcome to a new video. I saw this little cute family today and they were walking around and they were laughing over the small things. They picked up a little flower and they gave it to the little kid and it made me come back to the idea of why I started YouTube in the first place. And while there's so many new YouTubers coming on board in 2022 and every new year, I think an important thing to talk about is the fact that you shouldn't be making YouTube content for everyone else. I think you should be making it for yourself and there's two ways about this. One can be very counterproductive in the sense of whether it's going to say you're going to grow or not. But the other argument is if you're making content that's not something you enjoy and you're doing it purely for the views and subscribers, it's not going to be long term sustainable. Maybe in the short term it will be, yes, but long term you're definitely going to struggle. So one of the things I've learned over this last time and like, you know, making these videos since last year, while my growth hasn't been exactly fast and in fact quite slow, I've realized a couple things. One is consistency. Obviously uploading, uh, you know, whether you say once a week or twice a week, whatever your kind of schedule is and how much you can fit in, obviously with work and stuff, sometimes that's difficult and it's not feasible as it is for me but I do try and upload as much as I can. But I think the second most important thing is creating content that you really enjoy. You know, I think the most important thing with YouTube is that you're making content that you want to watch, that you enjoy making, that you know tomorrow you're going to wake up and you're going to want to do it again. With me, like, I love making content. Like, I can't really find myself doing anything else. I mean, obviously, I, I work and do all these other things as well, but... YouTube for me is something that I'm really passionate about and that I really love. It's not necessarily about the money, it's more about, you know, being able to, you know, one day do YouTube full time and make a living off that. Like that for me would be a dream because then I can really focus on, on the content that I want to create and and do it for you guys. We, we become sort of like a family and we have a community. Like that's something that really resonates with me is um, creating a community one day that you know I can call family you know my extended family and I'd really love to get to that point but I feel you know in the beginning I understand there has to be uh, you know some sacrifices and I think this applies for especially the more newer upcoming uh, creators where you know for me at least let me give you an example on my channel I find that when I do comprehensive reviews and um, you know like an overview of my cameras they really resonate with viewers I get I get a lot more views and uh, comments and I, I, I enjoy them while, while I well it's not my favorite thing to do like for me I, I'm more of someone who likes the talking head and like you know doing kind of like philosophical talks or you know going out and you know doing a bit of vlogging whether it's travel or whatnot it's sort of a bit broad but it's all around the range of photography and videography my review stuff and the overviews seem to do the best and so you know, I, I resonate with that and I'm accommodating to that. So there's going to be a new video coming out soon for the A7S III uh, because that's what I'm currently using and I absolutely love this camera and I want to do a little dive, a uh, deep dive in it uh, with an advanced overview as well as I've done with the R6 and the R5 and then eventually compare them as well and kind of tell you guys the differences and everything like that. Uh, at the end of the day, I think it's the most important thing to take away is that you're making content that you're happy with and that you enjoy making. Because as I said, in my opinion, if you keep doing content that you you don't enjoy but you do it because you feel like it's gonna get you more viewers and subscribers and stuff like that, it's not a long-term thing, in my opinion. It won't, uh, you'll eventually get tired of it, you'll eventually hate it, and you, and you may eventually quit. I remember at a time, um, you know, when I started YouTube first on another channel, just uh, for a little time, I was uploading very consistently. Um, sorry, that was just a phone call. Uh, just going back to my point, I was uploading very consistently, and while I while I enjoyed it, I was looking at the numbers too much at the analytics. And when I realized that I wasn't getting any growth or not going anywhere, I got upset and just quit. And what I realized is, and I think what a lot of people don't realize is YouTube is a long-term goal. It's not something that's gonna happen overnight with, with obviously maybe a few exceptions, unless your video goes viral, which is very unlikely. 
it's going to be a long-term goal. This is something that's going to be for the long term, and it's in, it's it's going to be very slow growth. And eventually, one day, it's like a snowball effect. Eventually, it will take off, and when it does, then you'll see some serious growth. But for the meantime, my advice, especially as an as an upcoming creator that's still very small, is just to keep uploading content and do it because you enjoy it. Don't focus on the money. There was a great quote that says, uh, "Don't chase the paper, chase the dream." And eventually, the irony is the money will follow. So keep at it, guys. Don't give up. Keep going. Keep making the content that you guys enjoy. And eventually, the people that like you will follow you, will subscribe to you, and will be a part of your community. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just something that was on my mind lately, and I, I think it can resonate with a lot of uh, upcoming artists, upcoming creators. And uh, yeah, if you like this video, please give it a like. If you have a comment, please let me know your thoughts on it especially if you guys are an upcoming uh, creator as well. And hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I'm going to be uploading a lot more content really soon. And uh, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Have a great one.